Hey guys, so sorry the lighting is a little bit off. I'm sitting in front of my window over here. It's hot as hell in this room, so I'm trying to do this to record this very quickly because I don't have an AC in this room and my AC is all the way over there and I need to be standing in front of it right now. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys this hair. This is a twist out using some products from Unicurl, which was actually one of the products that I mentioned in my um, huge natural hair care haul. I finally tried out some of the products from that haul and this is from the line Unicurl. Um, I actually really like how it turned out. Um, I would definitely give you guys my thoughts throughout the video um, on the product that I use. I only use their styler. That one styler is like the four in one styler. I just use that for this hairstyle. I like how it turned out. You guys know I love a little frizzy hair moment. So like, don't come with me about the fridge. I, I'm i here for the frizz. Um, but it did give me some really great def definition and my hair is super soft. But as I'm going through and doing the voiceover, I will definitely give you guys my thoughts on the process and the products that I did use. I didn't use everything from the line, but I used about four of them for this particular hairstyle. Um, well, for the style itself, I just used one product, um, but then I use like their shampoo, the deep conditioner, and their like moisture sealing oil um, as well. So I will give you guys my thoughts on each of those products as I go through. I didn't show you guys me actually in the shower, um, but I do talk about the shampoo and the deep conditioner in the video as well. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, definitely thumbs up. And if you are new here, consider subscribing. And don't forget to turn your notifications on so you do not miss an upload. And yeah, let's hop into this video because I'm getting really hot sitting here recording this. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Again, thank you so much for stopping in to check out my channel. I really, really appreciate it. All the links for everything that I use will be listed down in the description box as well as my shop where you can get these earrings and some of my hair and body products as well so okay okay for real we're hopping into the video Okay, so before we hop into the video, I just wanted to show you guys that I did use the conditioning two-in-one shampoo, which I actually really enjoyed. Um, it didn't leave my hair super stripped, but my hair was very clean. Um, after that, I did go in with the deep conditioner. This had really good slip, guys. I'm not even going to front. It had really good slip. Um, I did apply the four-in-one styler. I didn't have anything on my hair after I got out the shower. The only thing I did was spray my hair with some aloe vera juice um, and then I applied the 4-in-1 styler to my hair and I just started twisting my hair with each section. Um, I kind of braided the roots and then twisted the end. I guess people are calling this a tweed out now but I feel like we've been doing this for a long time now or I used to do this a lot especially when my hair was um, short <laughs> but um, I only braided probably about like three you know three braid arounds and then I twisted um all the way just so that my roots can stay a little bit more stretched than normal and I just repeat this all over my hair um I will say applying the four in one leave-in it did make my hair feel super um soft but I don't you'll see at the end um I don't know if it gave me quite the hold that I was necessarily looking for for this twist out to be honest um but i'll get into it a little further towards the end of the video um and you guys just see me here greasing my scalp you know i do use my blue magic on my scalp sometimes not all the time but i do like to use it when my um scalp is damp um as well now just a little fyi i do grease my scalp with either my blue magic or i use an oil but next again you guys will see see i braided a little bit maybe like one fourth of the way down and then I go in and twist the rest to the ends. I actually like how this come out. I haven't done this method in a while just because I've been kind of lazy with this but I actually like how it you know how it keeps my roots looking nice and you know kind of lay flat so to speak. Um, and my hair looks really shiny here guys. You guys are going to see once I'm finished. Um, I'm going to kind of zoom in when I'm finished but my hair was super shiny with this product I'm not like it was so shiny um, I wouldn't I didn't really use this product to detangle um, 
because I kind of detangled with the deep conditioner in the shower. Um, so I didn't really need to use this product to detangle, but I can see how it does have slip. Um, and I just go in with my tangle tweezer brush, kind of smooth out my edges, just so I didn't really have to do too much smoothing out after I took the um, twist down. <laughs> This is how it looks after I applied all of the product. It looks so cute like this, honestly. I haven't worn my, my hair in like twists like this in a long time, but it looks super cute. Like, I feel like it was gonna be really good. These are the twists um, after the fact. So I'm gonna go in with the hair oil and I just apply it to my hands. As you can tell, my hair was shrunken like a mug. Um, as you guys can tell, before it was touching my shoulders, now it's like, to my chin so it does have some shrinkage um and i just go in and start taking down the twist um and i do like i do like the definition that it gave me but i don't know i just felt like once it came for me to separate i don't know i'm not the best separator either because i always like a little bit of fridge so i don't really be taking my time i take my time but i still just kind of pull wherever i feel like it but I feel like at the end, my hair was a little frizzy, um, but it could have just been me because that's just what I usually do and what I usually like. I do like the hair oil. Actually, I'm curious to see how this would work with the gel, like adding the gel to this, you know, kind of method with, you know, the twist out. I'm kind of curious of how that will work out. I may try that in the future, but I do actually want to use the gel for a wash and go maybe in the next couple of weeks. And they do have the twisting cream as well. The elongating crisp twisting cream, I think it's called. They have that as well that I need to try out. So I'm going to be using these products for a little while, um, you know, when I want to do like certain hairstyles and trying it out. So I do like it. I think it's a really nice product. If you guys haven't checked it out, definitely check it out. I will have the link down in the description box. It's a really cool product. Nice. Would I say I'm down for the four in one styler? No, I would probably use an actual leave in conditioner first and then go in with this. I don't think my hair, I feel like my hair needs a little bit more moisture than with just this product. It's not awful, but I just feel like the type of moisture that I am used to having that first base of an actual leave in before I use a styler. Um, just feels better to me like my hair was soft but it wasn't as soft as it could have been if I use a leave-in as well so I will say my hair was soft but again not as soft as it has been using other products and I mainly think it was because of the fact that I did not use an actual leave-in conditioner which I feel like that is key for me for my hair is to have that leave-in conditioner like the four-in-one two-in-ones those type of things just usually don't end up working for me in the end but I wanted to use it as it kind of, you know, promoted itself. So that's why I did it this way. But I think I'm going to go in next time and actually lose, use the leave-in conditioner because they do have a leave-in conditioner that I do have. I just obviously didn't use it for this video. But I think next time I am going to use an actual leave-in conditioner before the styler just to give my hair that nice, soft, pillowy type of wash and go braid outs that I like. Not wash and go twist out and braid outs that I like and how like just soft my hair feels and I feel like it was missing that so it's good if you just need your hair to last for a couple of days but if you're looking for like that that type of moisture that lasts the whole entire week I'm gonna say for me and my hair we need a leave-in conditioner and I feel like also with the shine, I feel like over a couple of days, um, I felt like my hair got a little dull, which again, I think that goes back to the fact that I did not lose leave-in conditioner, um, which is something that I usually 
do. So that's just my thoughts on these products. I do like them, but again, you know, with using new products, you know, you still have to do what works best for your hair, even though they may be promoted a certain way, which is fine. They do make a leave-in conditioner and my hair just, honestly, I don't know what stage my hair is in right now, but it needs that extra moisture boost. So that's just my two cents on that. Um, so you guys see me here pretty much just separating my hair and I'm just going to pretty much do that. And that is really it for the video guys. I hope you guys enjoy. If you guys have any questions or any hairstyles you guys want me to do or products you want me to try out, or if you saw anything in my natural hair haul and you were like, why didn't you use that in a video? Let me know down in the comment section and I will try to film that for you guys. I actually have, I don't want to say a lot more time, but I definitely have time to definitely film and get some things out for you guys so leave your request down below don't be scared do not be scared or if you see any you know any other kind of videos that you guys want to see from me leave it down in the comment section i got you okay i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for stopping in and checking out my channel don't forget to go to my shop shop .com to check out my earrings and hair and body butter um and yeah i will see you guys in my next one follow me on snapchat twitter facebook instagram all of the links will be down in the description box as usual and yeah i will see you guys in my next one bye guys